we're going to need to generate electricity in the places that have a lot of sun and distribute it to the people that don't have a lot of sun. Actually, no. So Tony Seba, if you go into the details of the Tony Seba's reporting, they have done the math. They have gone into uh, the northeast of the United States. Well, for, for instance, Norway and Finland, some of those countries are some of the most electrified already. They already have the wind and solar uh, and the uh, battery backup in order to become almost self-sufficient. But Tony's done the math and he says he's done it for New England states. He's done it for the for Texas. He's done it for. So he's gone around the country and he said, no, all of these places, the solar that we have today, the wind that we have today is already efficient enough to be able to go 100 percent electrified right now, not even including the uh, the potential for for improvement over the next seven years or 10 years or 20 years or whatever else. So we will get more and more efficient. The distributed model that I suggest to you would certainly be the most difficult because you're counting on lots of consumers, but you also have the ability to have the government say, no, you will have it on your roof. Um, you and I mo both know that. Now, it doesn't mean that, it doesn't mean- I don't want Joe Biden and Donald Trump deciding what goes on my roof. Okay. But I'm just saying, but they, they already decide, right? We already have plenty of, I mean, the United States. They don't state decide what goes on my roof, no. State of, state of California right now. If you, you, know, California, you, can, you, can, you live in communist California. I live in I live in free Florida. Okay, but, but you have lots and lots of things about your house that is determined by the government. It determines how the power comes into the house. It determines what kind of electrical thing you put on the side of your house. I mean, you know, there's tons. And that's one of the sad parts about building today is the permitting required in order to meet the code. So this would just yeah. be one more code thing is you must have solar panels on your roof. Now, somebody says, well, I don't have the 10 grand. Well, that doesn't matter. We'll put it in there and it won't cost you any more. Already, already true. You can you can get uh, uh, the local uh, the local solar guy to come out, put the, put the solar on your roof right now and guarantee that it won't cost more than you're paying uh, for your energy bill as it is today. Click the link below to get your paperback, Kindle or audiobook now.